Hi guys, in this tutorial we are going to learn how to compare parts and assemblies. Bottom left is the command prompt indicating you to further instruction or changes. Let me demonstrate by drawing a member and changing its properties and comparing it. To compare a part or assemblies, the part numbering must be updated or the parts has to be numbered at least once. Select the members to compare and right click and select compare part. You can find the values that differ at the bottom left. If the parts are same, you get the command prompt indicating the part seems to be equal. Note, if compare part is provided, no properties related to assembly will be compared. Let me demonstrate by changing the assembly numbering values. Now if I compare parts, the values will be same. If I compare assembly, it differs. Now if I change any values related to part, say if I change the part numbering and give compare now, The command prompt show a change in values. The rotation of the member does not affect the part, but the assembly value changes based on the position of part welded. Let me demonstrate by comparing rotated part. Here it is same. Providing shortening values does not change the member in model, but the properties are affected. It can be identified by comparing the parts. Now let us check the methods to compare assemblies. Now I have welded plates on all members to create assemblies. Now if I compare the members with respect to assembly, any change in property will be shown in the command prompt. One of the easy methods to compare and check assembly is to create reports of the assemblies to identify the changes. To open report, press Ctrl plus B and choose assembly list. You can see the profile of the main part is different. Likewise, you can create report of individual members of the assembly also. Choose assembly part list to identify the members in an assembly. You can see the changes here. That's it guys. We have seen how to compare parts and assemblies. See you at next session.